Hello everyone and welcome to this week's autograph update. Let's just get started. So on Wednesday the 7th of February I received one autograph and it was an eBay purchase but my dad actually purchased it for me and I'm so excited because it is a book and it's one of my favourite books signed by one of my favourite authors so I'm really happy with it. And it is The Lovely Bones, signed by Alice Siebold. I, oh, I just absolutely adore The Lovely Bones. It makes me cry, but I love it. So I already have a copy of this book, and uh, it's very, very well read. And if you don't know, it was also adapted into a movie starring Saoirse Ronan and lots of other people, and it's a fantastic movie as well. So if you haven't, I highly recommend you read The Lovely Bones or watch the movie. But like I said, get a box of tissues and prepare to be devastated and cry in your eyes out. Anyway, this is, of course, signed by Alice Siebold. There's a nice picture of her. And there's the signature, and I'm just so happy. Nothing can describe the feeling of when your favourite uh, book is signed by your favourite author, or one of them anyway. So that's a signed copy of The Lovely Bones by Alice Siebold, purchased from eBay and technically a gift from my dad. So thank you, Dad! <laughs> Sorry for the background change, but at the minute it's too cold um, to record in that room, so I'm in my bedroom. On Thursday the 8th of February, I received three autographs and uh, one kind of fail. So we'll talk about the fail first quickly. I've ordered quite a few signed books off eBay because I wanted to get more signed books and I did order a Gordon Ramsay autobiography. Um, the seller said it was signed. It came today and unfortunately it's not signed so I'm going to try and get my money back for that. So that's the one fail of the week. I've received two books today both eBay purchases. The first one is this massive Marie Antoinette book. Um, it's huge. I didn't realise how big it was when I bought it by Antonia Fraser. Uh, Marie Antoinette is someone I'm just interested in reading more about. And of course, as it's in this autograph update, the book is signed just there. So that's another signed book to add to my collection. And the next signed book I bought is a Doctor Who Target book, Doctor Who and the Visitation by Eric Sarwood. I don't know how to say that. As you can see, it's a Peter Davison novel and it is signed by Peter Davison. I do have his autograph once already. And this is also, I believe from the listing, his wife or partner at the time. They are no longer together. I was interested in getting more Target books anyway. I know uh, my friend Emily of Emily's Autograph Collection has a lot of Doctor Who novels. I am interested in getting them. It's just room. I don't have any more room for anything else. So that's the two signed books that I got today. And the last autograph I got today was a TTM reply. And that was from Tom Knight. And I know Tom Best is the guy next to Mark Williams. He's obviously not Mark Williams. <laughs> I know Tom Best for playing Mr Granger in Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Mr Granger was played by another actor, who I can't remember his name, in The Deathly Hallows. But I have since wrote to the other Mr Granger as well, so it'd be nice if I could get them both back. But there's Tom Knight's autograph there. You can't see it very clearly. It just says, Best Wishes, Tom Knight. I have also wrote to this lady here who played Mrs Granger before she was replaced by Michelle Fairley in Death the hallows and he is my third success who wrote on the note that I sent him so there's the nice letter and it says I'll see I can't read it very well but we'll see thank you for your something Emma um Emma Hermione Emma Watson was something very young when we filmed but very proud of the set and took us to look at the moving staircase and Daniel I'm assuming Daniel Radcliffe was very funny hope the magic continues at uh, Tom Knight so that's quite nice even though I can't read half of his letter unfortunately but another one for the Harry Potter collection that I didn't have before so thank you very much Tom Knight so on Friday the 9th of February I received one autograph in the post and that's yet another eBay purchase of yet another book so it's been a very book week this week for autographs graphs and it is a signed memoir of Peter Kay's Saturday Night Peter. I've been trying to get Peter Kay's autograph for a while. Memoirs of a stand-up comedian and of course because it's in this update it is signed best wishes Peter Kay. And that's it for this week's autograph update guys. I hope you enjoyed. Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe if you like this kind of thing and I'll see you all soon. Bye-bye.